today's video, I'm going to show you how to recreate this crazy CRT data tracking effect using a secret plugin, but also how to recreate it completely for free using an overlay pack I'm going to have linked in the description down below. Let's get right into it. First thing you want to do is create an adjustment layer on which we're going to add the tracery effect. Next, you want to pick and choose the target color. I'm going to go for the skin tone. And as you can see, we're going to get all of these boxes to pop up. Now, we're going to adjust the threshold as well as the blur strength to make sure it doesn't look too jittery. If you want to render the overlay over a transparent background, you can toggle on this option. And as you can see, it's going to give us a alpha background. Now, let's reveal all of the advanced settings. And as you can see, we can customize absolutely everything about this effect, whether it be the color, the line style, or even the text. I'm pretty much going to set everything to red for this example but once you're happy with how it looks we can add another effect which you might have guessed it is deep glow the only thing you'll want to do is change the input threshold to 100 percent and maybe lower down the exposure value and the radius as you can see this adds a little bit more pop to it and to get that crt look we're simply going to drag and drop it into the vfx plug crt template i'm just going to go ahead and import the template straight into my project file open both the before and after comp and then all we need to do is drag and drop our main comp into the before get rid of the source clip and as you can see when we go back to the after we have this beautiful crt effect applied um, now we just need to fix the scaling but we're going to scale it up a bit and mess with the position but as you can see this adds a really nice texture to it and i think it really elevates this overall effect if you don't need your subjects to be actually tracked but like this aesthetic i have a great solution for you you're not going to need any plugins and it's completely free just head to the description download the overlay pack and load it right into your after effects project i went ahead and imported the overlay pack straight to my project file as you can see there are 10 of them so uh it's literally just a looping pattern overlay over a black background but what's cool is we can add it on top of our footage just like we did with the original plugin and play around with the blending modes to get some really creative looks we're going to start off with the screen and add blending mode as you can see it blends it super nicely but i also really like setting it on subtract especially whenever i'm dealing with white studio videos and here's the final result make sure you let me know if you prefer the tracery plugin or the overlays and that'll be pretty much it for today guys i hope you all enjoyed this quick tutorial and like always if you want to get your hands on the best tools in the game check the first link in the description down below you'll find all of my packs and plugins and i will see y'all in the next one peace